Hey guys, this is the Huber part of Magic Hubers, and today I'm going to teach you how to clone yourself in Adobe Premiere Pro CS6. So, the first thing you need to do is just film yourself in ideally three different spots. That's the easiest thing to do. Well, these is probably two, but three is the best uh, you can... I think that three is the best. So, um, I'm, I film myself in three different spots. I film myself keeping on the couch. I film myself keeping right here. And I film myself right here. So, what we're going to do is we're going to start my... Where I want to start. Uh, just right here. I'm going to cut that and delete it. And I... Actually, no, I think I did it too soon. Uh, I'm on the couch, and, okay, that, there we go. And now I'm cubing, and I'm cubing, and I'm going to cut it where I'm done. It's better to leave more than less, because after that you can cut it better so uh yeah i'm cubing okay right here i hold up my cube you can just delete this and once i finish so i have finished cubing i'm gonna cut that out and move over here scrambling it scrambling it and i hold it up right here so now that that's all done, that was a really easy part. So you're just going to move them all on top of each other. And then you're going to click effects and you're going to type in mat with an E. I already did that. And this eight point garbage mat is what you want. <coughs> Excuse me. And you're going to drag this to the top uh, thing. Make sure you put this right here. So the top is right here. So you're going to click 8-point garbage mat, and that's going to allow you to come and just make your clones visible. So you're going to do that. Um, and now you're going to do this, drag it to the second one. Do the same thing so that your couch clone is visible. And there you go. That's really all that you need to do. And in order to watch it, you're going to render the files by clicking enter. And this is going to take a while because it's a lot of rendering needs to be done. So I'm going to cut this part out.